They are off. Poor beginning for driver's license. And someone at the start losing the rider, Resurrection Road, unseated the rider at the start. East Coast Swing uh, barrels on out for the lead. Malibu Party away racing in the second position. As Johnny McKee is on his feet walking off the main track under his own power. Golden Jasmine moves up a closer third, now overtakes second. Up one spot as Savvy Splendor is up and after the pace from fourth, only a length off that leader. Then comes Driver's License on debut. Races just in front of the gray, Loom Roos. Arlanza races mid-pack, just about nine or ten lengths off the lead, and four in front of Furster toast the Bulldogs. Then two lengths for the back, Graham's Future is next, and then Golden Mine is out at the back of the pack. Up the backside, well-strung outfield, at least 20, 25 lengths from tip to tail in the first quarter, 24 and three. It's East Coast Swing shows the way by a length and a half after a half in 48 and one. East Coast Swing, carving out the fraction, shows the way by a length. Here comes Malibu Party to the inside, challenging up to the outside. Savvy Splendor on the move. Uh, four wide, here comes Loon Roos, and Periutes has this one set down for the drive. And Golden Jasmine uh, moves a closer fourth as they race around the turn by the quarter-mile pole. And it's East Coast Swing, a daughter at exchange rate, trying to take them coast to coast. And after three quarters of 113 and one, she'll turn them on down three to the good. Uh, so here's East Coast Swing in her stateside debut. By the eighth pole, has a lead by three, now by four, now by five, as Golden Jasmine races up into second to the outside Malibu party, and between those two, Loon Roos, down to the wire. It's East Coast Swing to give Wesley Ward and Machado two on the card. She won by almost a half a dozen in front-running style. Malibu party was second.